So you want to become a nurse. Is it because of the nice uniforms or the glamorous display of nurses on Instagram and Facebook and you feel like ah, I want to become a nurse so so that's a ah, skill some maybe because of the scrubs and the stethoscope. Well, today I want to burst your bubble because if you find yourself having some of the reasons I'm about to give for entering into nursing, then you have to rethink and re-strategize yourself and reposition your mind well before entering the field because it might, it's not as glamorous as most nurses present it to be. So if you're interested, let's get right into it. The first reason why I think nursing might not be for you is that you are getting into nursing because of the money. Because you think nurses have a lot of money or because nurses are rich, well, nursing is not a get rich quick scheme or it's not a field that you are giving a lot of money money is sprayed on top of you and uh, within a few years of working you become rich with mansions and cars no if you've lived in this country for a while or if you grew up in this country you would have seen nurses on strike several times in this country either they're asking for better conditions of service or better pay so it should tell you that it's not that glamorous it's not filled with money and you are not well compensated if anything nurses in this country are overworked and underpaid so if you are getting into nursing because you think you get a lot of money they will pay you a buttload of money well you would have to re-strategize because even if money there is money in the field even if you really get rich because richness or wealth is person related or individual specific even if there is is the money enough to satisfy you is the money enough to get you through the stress you go through because this is hard work nursing is hard work and if the money is enough motivation for you to get through each day of work for the rest of your life then go for it but if not then you have to rethink your reason for getting into the field the second reason I think nursing might not be for you is that you are getting into the field of nursing or you want to become a nurse to make someone proud. You want to become a nurse to make your mother proud or your father proud. Maybe because your mom wanted to be a nurse but she couldn't go. So she wants you to become a nurse or because your father really admires nurses and wants to have a daughter who is a nurse. Or maybe you come from a long line of nurses in your family. So what is the obvious thing to do? but your passion isn't really there sweetie this job you clean poop you clean blood you deal with dead bodies you deal with a whole lot of things trust me none of the family members you want to make proud are going to be there to be cleaning the poop and all those things for you so if it's not what you really want to do sit your family down or sit whoever wants you to become a nurse and talk to them explain things to them Tell them what you really want to do and you'll be surprised that they might support you because what's the essence of working in a place that makes you miserable? And if you'll be working from the age of 21, 22, then you'll be working in the field for about 30 something years, unless maybe you divert in the future. But even if it's just five years and you divert and leave the field, it's still five miserable years. I can't imagine my life miserable for five long years. So sit your family down talk to them and then see the way forward. The third reason why I think nursing might not be for you is that you are getting into nursing because of job security. Because in Ghana, it's either teaching or nursing. If you are not a teacher, you have to become a nurse for your job to be secured. Yes, yes. If we're having this conversation around 2010, 2015, then I would agree that yes, nursing is a stable job and so anyone who is interested should get in. But baby, this is 2021. Like, even though COVID hit and everything was thrown into chaos and all that, it also brought a new era where social media is everything. Social media has a lot of resources, a lot of information available. You can train yourself in a skill that you're interested in without ever paying apprenticeship or spending years in apprenticeship. You can learn skills that can give you a livelihood. Entrepreneurship and self-employment is the language of the day. So you can't say that you are joining a field that you are not really interested in just because 
you want to secure a job a job that is secured yes but do you really want to be in a secure job where you are miserable as do you want to be in a secure job where you hate the field so much you don't you you become bitter and miserable and start venting out on your clients the people that you vouch to take good care of you treat them badly because you yourself are unhappy the fourth reason why i think nursing might not be for you is if you can't handle people if you can't deal with people we are in a customer service business we deal with people all the time our work is people centered so whether you are the public health side or the clinical setting you still deal with people and this job gives you the opportunity to meet the best kind of human beings in this world people that are appreciative kind and generous people that will make your day so good just by a little act of from them their appreciation and all that and you also get the opportunity to meet the worst kind of people that the world has to offer people that are so rude and so arrogant people that uh, like just think of somebody you can't stand you will meet some in nursing so if you know that you can't deal with people like you are quick tempered you can't take like stupid things from people or like you can't handle those things then the field might not be for you because you are expected to be smiling even when these things are going on you are supposed to be a better person you are supposed to be the one who diffuses the situation so you have to be calm and collected whilst maybe the clients or the clients relatives are um, doing their chakra things if you can't handle this because every day you have to deal with a human being if you can't handle this the nursing might not be for you the fifth reason why i think nursing might not be for you is if you are someone who hates learning you don't like learning new things you are always comfortable with the knowledge you have you don't want it's like your mind is you are not an open-minded person let me just put it that way you are not an open-minded person you feel like if you struggle to learn something you should hold on to it for uh, as long as you can but nursing or healthcare in general is a ever-evolving field it's a field that the things you knew yesterday can all be annulled the next morning and you have to adjust and then move on because it's kind of uh, okay we know this is working today and then tomorrow we wake up and it's oh it's not working anymore it's giving people this it's giving people that so we are going with this now so everybody has to adjust and workshops and trainings and seminars are coming all around the training you get or the things you learn in the nursing school is Pisco, like Pisco, it's just a small knowledge, like basic things that will help you build up your knowledge on the field. When you get to the field, you realize that things are so different that you have to adjust to. So if you are not someone who grabs things easily, who is willing to learn and consume knowledge and information like you are crazy, the next thing might not be for you because you might be doing things the old way that is not approved anymore and put yourself in trouble. Or you might be doing things that are a cake and putting your patients in danger so nursing might not be for you if you don't like learning but if you find yourself having one or two or three of the reasons I, I I just explained it doesn't mean that you can't thrive in the field of nursing it doesn't mean that you can't perform but if you have these reasons this video is just to help you to rethink re-strategize and repurpose your mind you know anything we set our minds to do we can achieve so maybe you are joining becoming a nurse because your family wants you to or maybe you are becoming a nurse because of job security that's okay but purpose your mind that okay this job is going to be stressful the schooling process is going to be stressful you have to go for clinicals write exams and as for final year prior we'll get there someday it's all stress 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 through it all but if you purpose your mind that this is what i want to do you can still go ahead and then achieve what you want to achieve you know the fingers are not the same so this might be someone who has all the passion and all the zeal to be in the field but you realize that the pressure the stress and all of those things 
can make that person give up on the film but you who really really have good reasons might even fall in love with the field and who is to say that you are not worthy of the field so i guess this video is just to like awaken your spirit it's like to touch on your mind to have the right reasons for joining the field of nursing and that is it for today i hope to see you in my next one like this video and share with a friend and i'll see you in my next one bye guys